everyone, welcome to the side quest episode 2, episode 19 of Paper Mario. We're gonna go ham. I've been sitting here just looking at recipes and writing stuff down. I've got a couple pages worth of stuff I've wrote um, just for recipes alone. So we're gonna go ahead and we are going to do that first. We're gonna, we're gonna start off with the... Um, We're gonna start off with the recipes. Sorry, I've got I've got a lot that I'm looking at right now, and I'm trying to make sure that it all stays in line. That way we can do this nice and clean and get it busted out. I'm very excited to what, for what we got going on here. So we are going to be making 26 recipes, if I am not mistaken. We got a nutty cake, a nut cake, which is baked by Tasty, restores 10 HP. Very nice, very nice. Now, would you like me to cook something? Of course I would like you to cook something. Are you crazy? So, I'm gonna start doing them in order now. That goom nut one was just because I was feeling super fancy and I felt like it had to happen. No, I don't wanna use another ingredient. I just want to cook up a nice little potato. Very nice. Got ourselves a potato salad. How about that? Go ahead and uh, mark that one off. Very nice, very nice, very nice. And we're gonna go back into it. And we are going to cook up this lime. Nope. Just the lime. Heck yeah. So we're going to cook up that dang old lime. And then we are going to get moving on a little bit. Things are about to get crazy. Tasty tonic. We've all seen a tasty tonic. It's a basic, basic item. You can just make them. So we have got a melon. Of course I'd like you to use another ingredient. Psych! Make with one, please. We are just gonna go ahead and cook with this regular old melon that we got from this Yoshi. You remember. Tra la 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 la, she says. And that is gonna be a special shake. It smells delicious. A smoothie made by Taste Tea restores 20 FP. Nice. Now, cool little thing that we're gonna get cooking here. We are actually going to cook the strange leaf with the special shake. Ho oh, ho! Yes. So we actually get two out of the melon. This is going to give us... Oh, sweet success! This dish is one of my specialties. Here, please. A healthy juice. 40 FP. Here, let, me, let me actually read it for real. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to uh, didn't mean to pop off that real quick. Here we go, how about that? A juice blend made by Tasty. Restores 40 FP. Craziness, craziness, craziness. Alright, now let's go check out our inventory real quick. Or actually our shop inventory. Um, like what they're holding for us. Because I got everything set up and we should only have to go get stuff that we need to buy. And I'm going to go ahead and sell the Tasty Tonic. We don't have any room for anything, so I'm probably just going to sell everything we make. Because I was crunching numbers and trying to get things to work and all that. Here we go. Let's go ahead and go to Claim. What are we going to go with first? We're going to go ahead and pull out a coconut. Strange Leaf. Thank you, sir. An egg. Um, what else do we want to pull out of here? How about... Uh, the next 
page. Oh, gotcha. A melon. And another strange leaf, if we've got it. Actually, let's grab cake mix while we're at it. And then we'll grab a strange leaf and we'll get the heck out of here. How's that sound? Yes, we actually are in full inventory. Very nice, very nice. It's going well. I'm going to have to buy a bunch of mushrooms, regular old. We're going to have to do some stuff with that. We're going to have to use up our strange leaves. We should be okay. So, first things first. I'm going to give her a coconut. And then I'm going to give her a cake mix. This is one I've been looking forward to for a while. Mm, Cocoa Pop. This recipe's not too bad. A sweet candy made by Tasty. Resource 3 HP and 15 FP. Yep, very nice. Just a little Cocoa Pop. And next, here's another one I've been sort of looking forward to. Looking forward to getting done, more like. Ha! I'm gonna go ahead and give her an egg and a strange leap. How about that? And you know what that's gonna make? Here you are, this recipe's not too bad. A boiled egg. Food cooked by Tasty. Restores HP and 8 FP. That's fine. It ain't worth a it ain't worth a freaking strange leaf. I'm not going out and get one of those for that. So we're gonna give her a cake mix. We're gonna give her a dang old melon. And she's off. Tra-la-la-la -la -la and all that. and get ourselves a Yoshi cookie. How about that? We're actually going to keep that on, on us. So, we are going to give her next a cake mix. And we're going to give her a strange leaf. Seems like a gross combo, but I'm okay with it. Going to get ourselves a strange cake. A strange cake. This one electrifies Mario, turns him transparent, or makes him sleep. Yeah, pretty trash. Alright. Let's head on out of here once again. That may not have been the most efficient one we could have done, but we're doing okay. I, uh, this isn't as uh, structured as the last one. Uh, it's definitely structured, it's just like, you know, we're coming to the end, so it's like... I got a lot to look through, and I'm sure you guys don't mind. Boiled egg. Some that Cocoa Pop. Yes, thank you. Oh, we're going to keep those other two things. The healthy juice is pretty cool. And the Yoshi cookie I think we might need for a quest later. I don't know. Oh, we're going to keep that Goom Nut on our person. And we're going to claim some more items. So, we're going to take this strange leaf. We are going to take this Koopa leaf. We're going to take this red berry. And we're also going to take this dried pasta. We are going to take a dried fruit. We are going to go ahead and take an ultra shroom. And lastly, we're going to go ahead and pick up a maple syrup. Um, it's come to my attention, we don't have enough jam and jellies or... Well, we need one more jam and jelly, and I think we need one more ultra shroom, perhaps. Perhaps on that ultra shroom. Um, we'll actually, we'll see on that front. But regardless, let's get back to cooking. I'm going to cook up a dried fruit. And I'm going to cook, cook up a dried pasta. Go ahead. That seems uh, pretty delish. I wouldn't mind that. 
And we're gonna go... I guess I'll set a timer, but we're gonna go till I feel comfortable with us being done. Uh, we got a yummy meal, tasty food, cooked by Tasty, resource 20 HP and 20 FP. Uh, I don't say the word yummy, or I would have called it that, alluding to what it was called. That would have been fun. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and set the timer for 50 minutes. Go ahead right there. We'll probably go over that a little bit. That'd be okay. We got a lot to get done today. We got a lot to get done today. Strange Leaf. We're gonna give her that. And we're gonna give her a red berry. I don't know if this works with the other berries, probably, but I only wrote down red berry. And there we go. Oh, very nice. Sleepy sheep. You know what a sleepy sheep is. Puts them to sleep. Not the best item in town, but it'll work. So, we need a maple syrup. And an Ultra Shroom. We all know what that's going to turn into. Alright, we got a Maple Ultra. Dessert made by Tasty. Restores 50 HP and 10 FP. Cool. Um, we're going to start buying some stuff now. We are we are really making uh, progress, which of course I'm not surprised. I'm just more so stating it. A hundred coins for a maple ultra. How about that? Couldn't sell that sleepy sheep. Couldn't sell a yummy meal. I would like to check some stuff though, my friend. Check the maple ultra. I know this goom nut's been in my inventory, I've been meaning to get rid of it, it just hasn't been happening. Weird. Oh, it's because I need a mushroom with it. I didn't anticipate that. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and buy... Th Hold on, I'm going to pull out the dried fruit. I'm going to pull out, I'm actually, while I'm, I'm going to start doing this shot for shot. So we've got four in our inventory. I went and bought a Volt Shroom. We are going to need another cake mix, please. Should be our last cake mix. And we're also going to go ahead and grab out maple syrup. Okay. Well, do we have a Koopa Leaf on us? Is that, uh, does anyone know? Yep, we do. Awesome. I'm actually going to pick up a Super Shroom while we're here. We're going to stop at Tasty for one quick recipe. That way we can clear up some room in our inventory. Just real fast. Yes, I'd like you to go ahead and cook a Super Shroom. And Koopa Leaf. Yeah, if you wouldn't mind doing that for me. Thank, thank you. Tra-la-la. -la. It's going to give us a neat little item. It's a good way to, it's a, it's a cheap way to get these items, so it's a good way to grind your money if you really want to. Life Shroom. Not bad. Okay, so we're going to go to the shop in front of Toad Town. And we are going to go ahead and buy a few mushrooms and a fire flower while we're there. My friend, my friend. I need to sell you this life shroom. That's not a good way to make money, sorry. Life shrooms only sell for 20. It's a... Uh, free... Life shroom, I guess? I don't know. Cheap way to get life shrooms. That's all I can tell you. Can't get rid of any of this stuff. I'm sorry. So, we are actually going to buy one... Two... Three... Four... And we're going to buy a fire flower while we're here. Cool. So we got four mushrooms and a fire flower. 
I should have bought two fire flowers, but we just don't have inventory space. We'll be back. And we need more mushrooms than that, too. So we're going to have to take another trip to his place just, just once, uh, pretty quickly. Um, not too bad, not too bad. Okay, do I need to cook you something? Of course I'd like you to cook me something. I need you to cook me a mushroom. Go ahead and mix that with a maple syrup, if you would. If you would. And I hope you do. Check that off the list. We're gonna make a phenomenal progress here, everybody. I should have kept that life shroom. I really goofed, didn't I? Dang. It's okay. I just needed that for a recipe. And I didn't mean to... Well, I meant to do it. But I should have. We're gonna go with a cake mix. Hopefully our last cake mix. And a mushroom. Cook a mushroom and a cake mix. What are we gonna get? A check mark on this little paper. That's what we're gonna get. Here we are. A shroom cake. A cake baked by Tasty. Restores 10 HP and 10 FP. Cool. So, next, we're gonna go ahead and take a mushroom. And we're going to go ahead and cook it alongside a goom nut. We're finally getting rid of our final goom nut. We will never use a goom nut again. Tra la 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 la. Boom. There we go. Oh man, I didn't even need to buy that Voltrum, did I? Because we're using a Voltrum. And we're using a dried fruit. I didn't even need to buy that. Wow, how about that? Talk about being sloppy. Look at this guy. Got rid of his freaking life shroom. Thunder Rage. Very nice. So. Oh no. I might need another well who's to say what I'm gonna need let's get out of here we got some inventory cleaning to do that way I can really assess what what, what we've got I don't want to I don't want to get my shop my check filled super high again because I want to make sure I, I know what I'm looking at when I'm in there because we're getting down to business I mean this is we're almost done here Sell that. Go ahead and sell this. Go ahead and sell that. Anything else we need to sell? Uh, Voltrum. Don't need that anymore. Cool. So, we are actually gonna. Oh, sorry. We're going to claim. What would you like to claim? What do I want to claim? I'd like to claim a life shroom. Thank you. We're gonna have to go back and buy one more mushroom. Gonna need that dang old strange leaf. Yep, we're gonna need to go get one more dried fruit. But I feel like we're gonna get through this pretty quickly, so it's okay that we, uh, we need to go grab it. It's pretty quick. It's pretty quick. We need an egg. Finally. Another, do we have another strange leaf in here? We don't. We have to go get one of those too. Man, I'm getting sloppy. Sloppy, sloppy, sloppy. Um, I thought I had everything accounted for, but then eventually I was just like, let's just do it. You know, so <laughs> that's what we're doing. Um, let's pull out another jam and jelly. You know what? Let's get them all. Let's pull all our jam and jellies out. No, thank you, sir. Let me check my let me check my items. So we got three jam and jellies, a cake mix. Mm. We need another mushroom and I'm gonna go ahead and buy a super shroom while we're at it. Where is my super shroom? 
six, seven, eight, nine. I'll buy a super shroom here in a minute. Okay, dude, just come on. Don't make me beat you up. Ultra shroom. Cool. We are just about done with recipes. I'm pretty excited. I'm pretty excited. I'm gonna go with an ultra shroom. Oh man. And a jammin' jelly. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. This is one of the most intense recipes in the game. You know what I'm looking at. You know what's going on here. This recipe's not too bad. A dessert made by Tasty. Restores 50 HP and 50 FP. That is a Jelly Ultra. So we're going to go ahead and cook a jam and jelly. And we're going to mix it with a cake mix. That should be our last cake mix we ever have to use. How about that? Very nice. I have a feeling you guys know what's going to come out of this. It's pretty good stuff. Call can uh, get ourselves a jelly pop. A big lollipop made by Tasty. Restore 64 FP. That's another little 64 thing they hit in there. You can't even get up to 64 FP. It's just how it is. Man, I love that item a lot. So, we're going to go ahead and we're going to cook up a mushroom and a life shroom yes ma'am please go ahead and cook that for me tra la 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 and all that we're actually done with the second page of recipes very cool shrimp steak a dish cooked by tasty resource 30 HP and 10 FP So, we're going to go ahead, take this fire flower, and we're going to cook it with an egg. Oh, man. She wrote us mail about this, and I thought we had already done it. I was wrong. And that's okay. I'm okay with it. It's one of our final recipes there. This recipe's not too bad. Here, please. Egg missile. An egg bomb made by Tasty. Throw it to damage one enemy. Very cool. Very cool. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to cook up a strange leaf. I'm sorry. Make with one, please. We just need to cook up a strange leaf. There we go. There we go. There we go. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, all finished. I don't know exactly know what this is, but sometimes experiments turn out to be great. Here, please. A dizzy dial. You guys know what dizzy dials are. So, we have got, I think, five more recipes total. And I'm going to go ahead and go buy a mushroom real quick. Mm, I think that'll be the only mushroom we'll need. Let me look, let me look, let me look. Oh, sorry, I need to buy two mushrooms. Hey, excuse me, leave me alone. I'm a very important chef to be. Let me actually check the jelly pop. And I want to check the jelly ultra too. And I guess I'll check the egg missile for now. I didn't feel as though it was too, too important to do that, but we went ahead and did the egg. Shroom steak. Nope, we need to buy one, two mushrooms, very cool, a fire flower, and we need to, we don't need to check, we need to claim. And we will need this last potato.
So we're going to need a dried fruit, a strange leaf, a jam and jelly, and that should be it. Well, I'm going to go buy a super shroom. I'm obviously going to need that, but that's not really, that's not that difficult. I'm just going to go pick it up real fast. I might pick up a Koopa Leaf, too. Um, I think I should. I know we already cooked one, but just for, just for list's sake, claim, sir? Oh, wait, I don't need to claim anything. I'm just so used to that now. Let me go ahead and buy that. Room. Just a regular old. No thank you. No thank you. No thank you. Just make with one, please. Just cook up my cook my mushroom. Tra la la, she says. Thank you for the fried shroom. Oh, a snack made by Tasty. Restore six HP and two FP. Just because it's small doesn't mean it doesn't matter. I'd like to use another ingredient. Of course I would. We're going to cook a flower flower and a nice potato. Here you are. This recipe's not too bad. Here, please. Frozen fries. A side dish made by Tasty. It restores 15 HP. Very cool. Now, let me check. Whoops. Full of miss inputs today. What's going on? I just got a lot to think about. Um, so we are going to cook up our final dish for the moment before we have to go do stuff. I need to go score another jam and jelly. I know I said I needed another ultra shroom, but I seem to have been wrong. Jelly Super, a dessert made by Tasty. Restores 10 HP and 50 FP. That's kind of bold. Kind of bold. So, I need to go get a dried fruit, a strange leaf, and a jam and jelly, but that's in Toad Town. Yeah, the people outside are being super annoying. I hope they don't hear me say that, but they are. All they do is scream at their stupid dog, and it uh, it doesn't obey. And I'm like, you know, just because you yell at a dog doesn't mean, you know, doesn't mean it's obedient. It just means you scream at it enough, and it's gonna get bored and come back. Uh, but whatever. Who am I? Who am I? Okay. So we got the we got the strange leaf. Let's go get ourselves a dried fruit. And, you know, I, the reason I'm not too worried about it is, one, it's just, it's very simple. It's very not difficult at all to, uh, to go ahead and, uh, pick up some stuff. And that, and I think it's fun to be able to see these places again. So, not bad. Hi. I hate that she's just screaming. It's annoying. Um, need to go get myself a dried fruit. Yeah, I said I would get the, uh, Koopa Leaf just, just for, just, just because. Just for list keeping purposes. <gasps> the Wheels! It's everyone's favorite Quizmaster Chuck Quizmo. Wanna try the quiz? Of course I do. Then let's go to the question. The bottom, the very bottom piece of the screen's cut off. I don't know if that's... If anyone can even notice. Cool question. How many windows does the Goomba house have? Just one. I should have got that so long ago. Here's your star piece. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. You've correctly answered six questions. Dude, there's 64 in the game. And we are going to complete them. We're going to have a massive Chuck Quizmo episode. It's going to be crazy. I might record it today. Uh, I might not. What's it doing? Like, what's your name? What's it to ya? 
What's your name? What do ya? What's your name? Ah! You know that episode. Maybe you don't. That'd be kind of sad if you didn't. It's pretty good. They're all pretty good. Okay, just need one. Gentlemen, we just need one. Last time I did this, I got one. And then I had to go find more pokies. There we go. Dried fruit. Let's get back out of here. This guy's freaked me out. Gotta keep going down. Just probably one more. Maybe two. Yeah. Bump attack, guys. I, bu I put bump attack on. That's why the pokies were just falling to my iron will. Bump attack's awesome. I love it in Thousand Year Door. Um, I don't use it much in this game because I just use spin attack. And bump attack costs five, and I'm like, oh my god. You know, and there's not a lot of back and forth in this game either. It's sort of you're just chugging along, which is awesome. So. We made a jelly super, didn't we? Why didn't I check that off, huh? Cool, cool, cool. Right. According to my calculations, we have two more recipes, and we're about to cook one. I'm actually going to do the Koopa Leaf one also, but we know what happens with that. So, we're going to take a dried fruit. I'm going to go ahead and cook it up with Strange Leaf. It's right there. Dried fruit and Strange Leaf. Yes, yes, yes. Holy cowski! Oh man, this might be the 49th recipe if I didn't mess anything up. Did she still go on with that stupid dog? Man? Fire flower. Thank you, thank you. Not bad. We could have done that right where we wouldn't have needed to buy one of the fire flowers, but it's okay. Now, I hope you all are super excited and ready to watch me hit this pig machine until we get what we need. Hey, shut up. I've already used this machine. I think you guys have watched me use it. Trash. If not, you deposit ten coins and it poops out one of these. And it's, uh... You know, how you get items or whatever. If we have enough cash, and I... God, I hope we so. I so hope we have cash. Because we can buy like 60 more pigs. And that's like... You might think that's enough, but like... What if it's not? You know, probability means that you could never get it. Hey, sweet, a gold pig. Yeah, because I showed off everything that this guy said, I'm pretty sure, in the last side quest episode. For each pig that you get, he's like, oh my gosh, a gold pig, and I'm like, shut up, dude. I will destroy you. Yeah, we gotta get up to ten, and then things start happening, if you forgot. So it costs a hundred coins to even get this thing to do anything. I went for the double item last time also, didn't I? That was cool. Well, that's great. That's great. We got the silver one. That's what we needed. I mean, we got it a little late for my taste, but it's okay. I would have liked for it to have been, like, the second pig we got. Instead, it was the eighth pig we got. So, it's okay. We just have to hit the machine eight more times after this, probably. If my calculations... Oh, we got it on our seventh pig. Okay. Unless it goes up to like 12 or something. I thought it was 10 though. A black pig. What's going on here? Am I just completely not respecting how many pigs are in that pen right now or something? That just means the silver pig's gonna die quicker. Get out of there! Oh god. I just wanna live in somewhere where. You know not ghetto people are. And I know people think, like, I don't know if people think this, but I feel like ghetto might insinuate some type of 
race or whatever, and that's 100% not it, so don't even come at me with that stupid garbage. Um, it's just, you know, poor white people are worse than any black person I've ever met. Period. <laughs> um, I've, I've seen quite a few uh, folk in my life, and, you know. But, yeah, I just, I just, I like being... I like being... I like when things are quiet. And just people are not quiet. And I wish they would be. Um, yeah. Shame we couldn't get the Ultra Mushroom and the Jam and Jewelry. That would have been awesome. But that jam, that, that Ultra Mushroom's long gone, dude. By the time this thing poops out, we'll be lucky if the Maple Syrup's still there. That's a joke. The Maple Syrup's 100% gonna stay. Okay, are we gonna get a life shroom and a jam and jelly? Gotta be quick about it, but... I mean, that'd be really cool. Yep. Ah, whoa, he threw him close, he threw him close! Come on! Gentlemen, gentlemen, come on, quick! Yes! We got a life shroom and a jam and jelly. Cool. That's what I'm talking about. We needed that jam and jelly. It only took a couple minutes to get to, so that wasn't so bad. Would, I, would you like me to cook something? Of course I'd like for you to cook something. A mushroom. And then a jam and jelly. That should be the 50th recipe. We're gonna cook one more thing, but if we're if, if I did everything correctly, and correct me if I didn't, that should be our 50th recipe. A jelly shroom. A dessert made by Tasty, restores 5 HP and 50 FP. Let me go ahead and just cook up this last coupe leaf. No. Oh, there we go. Everything on this list is checked off, so we're gonna go take a trip to um, our house. Coop tea. There we go. We aren't gonna need that Yoshi cookie. If, um, I think I was wrong about that. I was certainly. Almost a hundred percent certainly wrong. Almost went in that shop. I'm just so, you know, I'm in the movement of the cooking. Good song. I love coming to here. What are you doing? Princess Peach is still caught way up there in the sky. Come on, Mario. You're a hero, bro. You have to save her. Okay. Okay. Fine. You're not coming, are you? What? Tasty recipes, 50 out of 50. And then we have, real quick mental math here, 52 star pieces that are gonna come from Chuck Quizmo. So we've got, we've got, what, 52, on top of that would be 100 and, 144, so we're really missing 16 star pieces? Okay, I'll, uh, you know, I know this is the side quest episode, but this was more so just the tasty episode. Um, I am gonna, I am gonna search around for. I'm actually gonna, you know, get star pieces and stuff, and we are gonna have the Chuck Quizmo episode. You know what? You see, the reason I'm saying what I'm saying right now is because we have. Pretty much gotten every. I'm pretty sure we've gotten every single star panel, or star piece panel. I'm almost positive of that. That we have not missed anything, and we have went ahead and got that. So, I'm trying to think of star pieces that we can clean up. I think he's going to give us either three or six more. I've been hearing people. Talk recently 
Apparently, I'm not too popular. People are actually saying I'm cheap. The nerve. A long time ago, I used to... And, and then, you know, but... Can you believe... So I said... And then, you know, completely unfair and so very rude, despite my... Uh, and finally, here you listen to me. Well, the upshot is I really don't need any help, except, you know, all those boos living in Boo Mansion. Well, one of them has an old photo of mine. So, well, I'd, I'd like you to ask them if they'd give it back. And if you don't mind, could you hurry up about it? me go ahead over here real quick. I know this seems like I'm going the wrong way, but I promise I'm not. I need to grab one of these because he's gonna have a he's gonna have a quest for us in just a little bit. Let's see if the little radio guy, I wonder if we could do it again. No. Hot hits. Information station. But seriously folks. Oh, here's a big chance to win. Take a nutty cake to the front of dry dry ruins. Cool. Let's do that real quick. Because I have to go there anyways. And then I have to go to the boo place also. So, I'm just going to go ahead. You know, weirdly enough, we are going to go ahead and go back and get another goom nut. I lied. That only requires... Yeah, I was going to say a goom nut only requires a goom nut, right? If not, we're not doing it. I'm just curious what will happen. I've only done it. I think I've only done it once. I mean, unless, it, unless he eventually gives us a star piece... Oh, because if that's the case, I most certainly have done it more than once. Because I've got I've 100 percent of this game before. It's not it's not terribly difficult. You just have to know what you're doing and be willing to put in a little effort. Go and cook me a goom nut, would you? No, that's okay. Yeah, I need to go out there anyways. I don't need to go all the way to dry dry ruins, but. I gotta get out there anyways. I gotta get a lime and a, and a dried pasta. So, thank you for the nutty cake. We're gonna need to go get a coconut sometime, too. I'd like to get all this done pretty quickly. We still have about 18 minutes from what I'm comfortable doing, and we'll go probably two or three minutes over that without a doubt. Um, oh, sorry. I always want to go in that second one. That's the shop. Go ahead and pick me up a dried pasta, please. And we'll go ahead and sell. Oh, oops. Sell this. Yeah, we'll sell the coupe tea. We don't really need that anymore. There we go. Let's go find that eccentric looking toad, shall we? You know what? Hey, Chuck Quizmo. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, car wheels. It's everyone's favorite quiz, Master Chuck Quizmo. Want to try the quiz? We uh we stopped right in front of a wall. <laughs> Question: What's the name of the leader of the Red and Blue Koopa Brothers? Or Goomba Brothers? Sorry, Goomba King. Cool, we did it. Here's your star piece. There we go. Seven questions. So long, farewell. Until uh, we meet again. Now, let's go talk to that toad real quick. And I'll, I'll tell you what. We're going to go ahead and ride like a Lester. He doesn't get enough love, and it's pretty it's pretty easy compared to spinning and jumping and spinning and jumping. Even though spinning and jumping is faster, lack of Lester is just less buttons. Which I can't complain. So Koopa Coot, now that I'm looking at it, has six more star pieces for us. And that means we'll have ten unaccounted for, from what I'm understanding. Um, after the Chuck Quizmo ones. I, of course, will... I'll figure it out. You know, it's not like I'm gonna... Did you see all that sick dodging? That was pretty awesome. Tell you what, I think we have to go up one. There it is. Hello, I'm the Toad from the Trading Event. How are you? Did you bring the item? Not a cake. Congratulations, this is the item for today. A maple super! Yeah, it wasn't worth it at all. Use it wisely. It was a maple syrup last time, so it's getting better. 
Get away from me, freak. Zzz. Yeah, we're just gonna keep going down until we hit the main road, and then we're gonna get going. Other star pieces are for letters. If you guys were curious what other ones we might be missing. Letters. We got the big old chain letter I said I was gonna get to here in a little while. If we have time, I'll do it this episode. Uh, that's only if we have time. Because uh, it's a bit of a long one. Um, and anything I don't get done in this episode, or the Chuck Quizmo episode, I'm going to go ahead and finish off before we start our next main episode. Um, yes, I think the Chuck Quizmo episode is probably going to be the next episode that happens. I think we're going to go ahead and just knock out some Chuck Quizmo. Because um, I just think it's... I think it's probably for the better. I mean, I might cut out, like, the trip walking back and forth from Chuck Quizmo um, to find him, because you gotta you got to keep walking back and forth um, throughout different... I just got to go in each tube and go back and forth and all this. And it's it's not terrible, um, but if I do feel like it, I will probably cut out a bunch of the walking. Uh, we'll see. We'll see, because that would, be, that would be a lot, cutting out all of that. But I could probably do it for you guys. We'll see. Is it you? Hey, what can, I, what can I boo for you? An errand for Koopa Koot, huh? Too bad for you. Koopa Koot's been known to use people, you know. His motto is, if it moves, use it till it drops. He got in a couple fights over his personality way back with the wind. After one really bad one, he started traveling a lot. This is a photo of us from when we passed through these parts. Take this and say hello to Koopa Koot for me. Old photo. Cool. Is this a picture of a young Koopa Koot? He wants this. Yep, very cool. We're gonna go ahead. I didn't pick up the lime. God, dude, come on. Why you gotta do that to me? I don't wanna go back. It's right, it's right next to the tube, though. It'll be okay. I know what you're saying. Koopa Koot's not this way. And to that I say, you clearly don't know what I'm doing. Give me a second. You might know what's going on. And cook there, I'll give you a coupe leaf. And I'm gonna give you a, coupe, a dried pasta. And if you guys uh, did watch the uh, side, quest, side quest episode one, you'll know what's going on here. It's got a coupe pasta. Very cool. Do we? We do! We have a coconut in our, in, in our shop inventory. Cool, we don't have to go do that. Awesome. I'm okay with that. So, we're going to talk to him. There we go. Great club in Clubbers! I mean all of you, Mario. All of the days of my youth. Just look at me. There was this utterly gorgeous, lovely, the passion, maddening, as best as I... And I never looked back. Anyway, enough of that. Take this as a token of my thanks. I wonder if we can go back and see what he actually said. This one. Oh, the days of my youth. Just look at me there, so young and vibrant. I was quite the ladies, Koopa, you know. And then he talks about the ladies. Oh, you don't have to be so polite. That's a, a whole coin right there. I really haven't had a tasty meal in a Goomba's age. Miss Tasty's Coop Pasta would really hit the spot right now. Could you head to Toad Town and have her whip up a batch? Did you hear my belly rumble? I'm ravenous. Please hurry up. Please don't let me starve. That's why we made this. Plummeting parrot. Goombas, you're a man of action, Mario. This looks simply delicious. I swear nobody could cook this dish besides Tasty. She's perfected the recipe. Here's a little token of my gratitude. Yo, well then, I seem to have misplaced my glasses, which is vexing. I suppose it must have dropped them somewhere. I haven't gone beyond the borders of Koopa Village, so long as it suggests there's somewhere in the village. Yep, we're gonna go shake all the bushes. I can't remember 100% where they're at, but we'll find them pretty quickly. 
I knew where the wallet was pretty easy because, you know, it's an early one. And the earlier um, quests are, the easier they are to remember. That's Koopa Leaf. Hey, Chuck Quizmo. Let's talk to him again. Kawiz. And let's get to the question. Question. What color are Luigi's pants? Blue. Very nice. Correct. You've correctly answered eight questions so far. Awesome. There they are. Let me read them. Let me read them. Don't worry, I'm gonna read them. Glasses Koopa Koop dropped. Deliver them to him. Got three letters right there. So we're closing in on the end of the game, guys. And I'm, um, you know, we gotta, we gotta figure out where all the badges are. We have 15, I believe, we're missing, which isn't too bad. Hop in hurt plants. That's what he said. My eyesight's really gone downhill these last years. Now I can once again read books without any trouble. Technology's great, isn't it? Here, I'll give you this to show my gratitude. A coin. Trash. This guy sucks. Dang it, there's a little lime. I've really been dragging my shell recently. I need a tart pick me up. Let's see. Oh, I know. A fresh lime should do the trick. Can you go find one? Hurry up if you could. I feel as slow as a tortoise. You promise? Okay, okay, okay. Let's go. So the lime shouldn't take us but just a minute to get. And that is actually... We'll only have three quests left for him to do. Be excited, we're almost done with Koopa Koop. We gotta go down, down, down. Pardon me. Pardon me. Go through here. So that's a lemon tree. There it is. Lime! See, that was pretty quick. It took us like 30 seconds. That was a life shroom, if you don't remember. Um, I didn't show it on camera, but that block right there was a life shroom. It seemed awful, uh, suspicious. So, I went ahead and hit it. Oh, if you made it this far, and you haven't watched, uh, episode 7.5, I urge you do. It was uploaded on the same day, and you might have missed a little bit. Um, I know that's a while ago. But, uh, there for a while I was reminding people to go back and watch it, and, you know. Just figured it would still be friendly to do so. Bye, spiny spikes! Are you for real, Mario? Mind-blowing! Crazy! Mm, yeah! What a sour lime! That'll put a spring in my step. You're a stand-up guy for doing an old Koopa so many favors. This time I'll give you a special gift as thanks. Three star pieces. I recently heard about a snack called a Cookie Cookie. It's supposedly delicious. I must confess, and I have a sweet tooth. So, do you think you could track one down? One of the ingredients has a Koopa leaf, but I can't remember the other. Hurry up if you can. I need sweets post haste. We're almost done with him. Oh, and I'm very excited. I am definitely glad to finally be rid of this goofball. But it's sort of just, it's also kind of bittersweet because, like, that's just another piece of the game we're gonna have to close the door on. Gonna go down here, grab this coconut. How handy that we had another coconut sitting around. Of course, it's not gonna go cookie cookie and then coconut, that'd be too easy. We gotta do something in between. And it's gonna be like, ugh, serious? Go. Lines are albino dinos. You world class, Mario. Albino dinos were the guys that I was pushing around that I said used to that were coded as enemies. So this is the cookie everyone raves about. It does look good. I think I'll save it for later. 
I'll give you this gift to show you my gratitude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There is one thing. I have an old boo friend who lives in Gusty Goats. Can you go and get him a package from him? You may have a little trouble finding him since the boos there look pretty similar. I'm sure you can do it, though. A long time ago, when Goompa Bootler and I were traveling, we met the Boo and became fast friends. He recently sent me a letter saying there's a package there addressed for me. What are you waiting for? Go on and get it. I mean, please. Yeah, so I gotta go to Ghost Gulch. Not too bad, it's just a real short walk. You guys remember Gusty Gold, it's where we fought Tupa Blubba. And that is the first time I uh, ever felt this series coming to a close. Um, now I feel that every single time I boot it up and start recording. <laughs> I, I just I don't want it to stop because it's like when I'm done playing this, I'm not going to be able to play Paper Mario again for at least a year. At least, I gotta. I can't go back and play it again in my own time for at least a year. Um, that's gonna be tough, man. It's like, I think about this game constantly. This is one of the games that lives rent-free in my head forever and ever. Oh, hello. You're running an errand for old Koopa Koot, are you? Uh-oh, now where did I? I wasn't really ready for this. Why did I leave that thing? I better go look for it. Um, do you think you can wait for a second? I should find it soon enough. So why don't you kill some time by wandering around here? And I believe we have to just step in here, step out here, and he should have it. Thank you for waiting. I finally found it. I can't believe it took me so long to drag it down. Anyway, please give my regards to Koopa Koopa, okay? Take care. A package. No, package. A package received from a boo. Delivered to Koopa Koopa. Not bad, and then we'll deliver him a coconut, and we'll be done with Koopa Koop forever. Yeah, it definitely hasn't been long enough for me to play Thousand Year Door again. I don't I don't have as much fun replaying Thousand Year Door as I do replaying this game. Um, I still put them both in, like, my top ten, dude. It's like, whew, it's tough to pick, it's tough to pick a favorite, but I think, I think... The more I play this game, the more I realize that this one really is my favorite of the two. But I don't want that at all to seem as though I'm not putting Thousand Your Door on one of the highest pedestals a game can be placed on, man. It's like, Thousand Your Door is... It is so good. It is... I don't, I don't need to tell you that Thousand Your Door is one of the best games I've ever played. It is way up there, man. It's like... It checks all the boxes. It's a 10 out of 10. I think anyone could pick that game up and enjoy it. Live it, lava piranhas! You rule, Mario! Ah, oh, yes, this is that package I requested. Ever since my boo friend sent me that letter, I've been dying to know what's inside. Well, I'll find out right now. After you leave. Here, take this as thanks. Oh, you don't have to be so polite. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is it. People keep talking about something called a coconut. They say they're delicious. I just have to try one. Go right away if you can. Promise to hurry back. Great! Crawling cliffs! You're larger than life, Mario! Hmm. How do you crack this thing? Oh, well, I guess I'll try it later. I'll give you this to show my gratitude. Oh, you don't have to be so polite. What? I wouldn't mind getting one of those red jars. What they say were made in dry, dry desert, ancient desert kingdom. According to popular opinion, you can get one if you buy things in a certain order at the shop in dry, dry outpost. First you buy a dusty hammer, then you go ahead and get a dried pasta, then uh, you get another dusty hammer, and then, let me see, hang on, I've forgotten the other thing. Ah, we have to figure out the rest, but do hurry, I really want one. Do I have your word? A jar, a little Mauser shop, a collector's item perhaps, red jar. 
We got this a long time ago. Swoop and shy sky, guys! You're a true workhorse, Mario! Incredible! Outstanding! Ew, it's a little filthy, though. Suppose I'll add it to my collection anyway. You're a stand-up guy for doing an old Koopa so many favors. This time I'll give you this special gift as thanks. Three star pieces. You're a good soul for helping this old Koopa so many times. Now, Mario, I have one last favor to ask. That cat, Bowser. You must defeat that evil king, Bowser, once and for all. The dear children of this village will never sleep in peace as long as Bowser rules. I wish for nothing more than peace and a reason for my fellow Koopas to hope again. Please help us, Mario. That's not a favor. That was just dialogue for the end. Um, and that's pretty much where we... That The timer actually went off at, while we were speaking to him. Um, let's look at this. 47 star pieces total. I'll tell you what. Real quick, since I said I was going to go over anyways, let's actually do it. And let's go talk to Merlot at Shooting Star Summit. How convenient. I didn't do that on purpose. We're going to go talk to Merlot at Shooting Star Summit. I was going to say let's go buy some badges with our star pieces. But, like I said, super convenient. Here, while we're on our way, real, really, really quick, I'm going to read everyone's mail at the post office, maybe. So we got a letter for everyone. We're going to read these real fast since this is a side quest episode. Guma. A letter to Goombario from Guma. Here you go. Dear Goombario, how are you, my cute Goombario? We're all doing fine here. I hope your tattle abilities will finally become useful. Stop by whenever you get the chance. We all miss you. Good luck, my little Goom Nut. I'll be thinking of you. Goomba. Of course. Goompa. The tattle ability is becoming super handy. Here you go. Dear Goombario, how goes the adventure with Mario? Is it fun? Are you being a brave Goomba? Remember to relish your time out in the wide world. Grow wise from your travels. I wish to the stars that your adventure will prove to be a fruitful one. If you can, drop in on us old folks now and again. Goomba misses you terribly. I'm looking forward to seeing you as a grown-up. Goomba. Would you like to read more? Red and blue Goombas. Here you go. Goombario, you were a lot stronger than when you looked. We figured you were just some punk Goomba hanging around with Mario. Anyway, you proved yourself to us, and you showed us that being good is as important as being strong. So, when you come back, do you think maybe we could be friends? Say, please say yes. We'll be waiting. Red and Blue Goomba Brothers. Cooper's Fan. Dear Mr. Cooper, I must apologize for sending a letter out of the blue, but I had to. I saw you walking in Toad Town with Mario. He seems so strong and brave. So dashing. If it's okay, I'd really love to have a talk with you. Oh, how embarrassing. I'll write you again soon. Good luck, brave Koopa. Your fan. Here you go. Dear Cooper, how goes the adventure? I can't believe you're hanging with Mario. I'm so jealous. Koopa Village is the same. Colorado's wife is impatiently waiting Colorado's return. You in Colorado, you guys have so much excitement in your lives. You're so lucky. Anyway, good luck, buddy. Coover of Koopa Village. Oh no. Dang it. We're not gonna read all these. I... I've let him build... Okay, come on. Here you go. Cooper, how are you doing? Your mother dropped by for a visit the other day. We had a really nice talk over some Koopa tea. She did seem a touch disappointed that you were still on the road. She said that she's going to cook a delicious dinner when you come back, so you have something to look forward to. Oh yes, if you happen to see my wayward husband, please tell him to come home more often. Take care. Call her on his wife. Cooper's done. Bomb bet. 
Here you go. Dear Miss Bombay, we write this letter as a humble request to you, the most worthy and explosive of all blah bombs. It's still a long time off, but later this year we will be opening we will be staging an opening event for a new dry dry railroad route. We feel the event would be a galabash if we could enlist your bob bomb bursting help. Bomb bursting help. Crowds love fireworks. Anyways, we'll get in touch with you after your adventure ends to confirm the dates. Sincerely, Dry Dry Railroad Transportation Department. Bruce. Bombed, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. I love you, 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 I love you. I love you, 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 I love you. Please understand how I feel. I love you. Your Bruce. Here you go. Bomb it! You must return to me, oh fair and combustible bomb bomb! My heart awaits you in Com Koopa Village. It burns like a fuse. I will love you forever, even if you reject me, my love will endure. If I don't see you soon, I'll surely explode, so please hurry. You've ignited my passion. Come back to me, my love. You're Bruce. Alright, that's where we're gonna stop. We still got five partners, but we're getting a. getting a little late on time. I said I was gonna end it a couple minutes ago. Um, I just figured. We'll get some of those out of the way during during that. That way we don't have to worry about coming back to it again. This is actually the place we need to go anyways. We gotta go up if we want to continue the game, but we're not gonna do that for just a little while longer. I would like to have every star piece possible before heading out that way, which means enlisting the help of Chuck Quizmo. swap his badges. So, we are start with the cheapest and probably just go up from there. That way we can just bust out as much totals as we can. And yeah, seeing 15 badges might have been a little disheartening that we still needed. I think it was 15. Um, but yeah, um, we'll, we'll be okay. It, it, the majority of them are these. And I know where, um, I don't want to say all of the other ones are. We'll go through and read these, by the way. Just before we end, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go ahead, read these badges, and if you guys are ready to go, I understand. I'll see you in the next video. But I want to make sure I read these off. If you do, if you have clicked off, I'll see you. So we got peekaboo. Makes it possible to see your enemy's HP. So that's in case you don't want to tattle things. It's super helpful. Flower saver. During battle, saves 1 FP every time you attack. Uh, he has one of those waiting for him. Um, waiting for us. That we didn't buy. So, Heart finder. After beating an enemy, makes more hearts appear than usual. Protects, um, feeling fine. is Protects Mario from poisoning and dizziness during attack. Flower Finder. After beating an enemy, makes more flowers appear than usual. I believe that's all we got from him. Though I swore we bought more than four badges. But it's okay. Most of our badges we've seen before. Definitely read Peekaboo. Yep. I read what Triple Dip does during battle. Let's use three items during one turn. Yep. So... I will see you all next time. Thank you all for coming out to the second episode of Side Quests, Paper Mario Episode 19, if I'm not mistaken. Hey, I'll see you next time.